There are three theological values, otherwise known as faith, hope and charity. Let's begin with faith. Having faith means believing and trusting. It's said that faith can move mountains, even the smallest amount of faith. That's true. When we have faith, obstacles in the way are removed and the pathway ahead becomes smoother and lighter as burdens are taken away. Jesus said in Matthew 17 verse 20, If ye have faith as a grain of mustard seed, ye shall say unto this mountain, Remove hence to yonder place, and it shall remove, and nothing shall be impossible unto you. It's amazing what we can achieve when we believe. Faith comes from listening and hearing. We have two ears and one mouth. So the design of our bodies tells us we should listen twice as much as we speak. When we speak, we're only announcing what we know. When we listen, we're learning. When we have achieved, it's important to show gratitude and give thanks. You've received because of your faith and belief. Give credit where credit is due because it wasn't you. It was God, or the universe, whatever name you choose. You had faith, you believed and trusted, but the hard work was done by God. Hope represents our dreams and desires. Hope is wanting something to happen, a feeling of expectation. Hope comes at its strongest in times of darkness to remind us that nothing lasts forever and even bad times have an ending. Hope tells us that balance is coming and the scales of justice will tip in our favour. Hope tells us that the wheel of fortune is turning as what goes up must come down and of course vice versa. It's said that charity begins at home. Home being ourselves, our loved ones, our family, our friends, our neighbours and community. When we think of charity, we usually think of giving to people, people who may be down on their luck and in greater need than we are in the current moment. We give and donate to them through gifts and finance and through charity shops and good causes. And we hope and trust that our donations are being received and arriving where we want them to go, to where they're most needed. It says in 1 Corinthians 13, verse 13, And now abideth faith, hope, charity, these three, but the greatest of these is charity. Charity in this sense, in the biblical sense, means love, unconditional love, divine love. Faith can move mountains, and hope takes us out of darkness, but charity is love, and without love we have nothing. Perhaps it could be said that faith is spiritual, hope is mental, and charity is physical, but also mental, emotional, and spiritual. Then it can be of no wonder why it's the greatest of all three.